all right my people and i welcome back onto this channel well this one another one will be saying the reach us hmm still on the matter my people yoruba nation no going back exactly waiting to be exactly waiting the people them they talk about southwest youth group cautions pahadebanjo afeni ferry on a fight for yoruba nation well on to this a yoruba youth group known as the yoruba nation youth boat home and the diaspora has insisted on continuing the fight for the actualization of the yoruba nation while cautioning yoruba elders especially some leaders of afeni ferry against being an impediment to the dream on to this one the group in a statement on a saturday after a press conference held in ibadan or your state declared that they would continue to fight for self-determination for the yoruba nation until it becomes a reality well meanwhile in the statement signed by its leader prophet ayodele ogun luluwa the group frowned at some elders uh, who they said have given up on the fight for a Yoruba nation self-determination but are instead calling for a restructuring mm, on to this one according to the statement to i quote we are not happy with the way and the manner the leader of a pan yoruba social political group afeni ferry chief ayo adebanjo and uh, some leaders in the southwest have been going about relegating the issue of actualization of yoruba nation the statement said why is afeni ferry always attacking the advocates of a uh, yoruba self-determination with a such terrible venom what do you gain from nigeria that makes you so feverish in defending the continued yoruba membership of nigeria what has the yoruba gained in nigeria secondly why is a body like afeni ferry never careful about creating the impression that we yoruba are viciously divided why can't you imitate the careful and the respectful manner in which we of the yoruba nation always speak of afeni ferry professor akinto ye wants us and then onto this one he wants us regularly to be respectful of our Feni ferry why can't our Feni ferry do the same is it in yoruba interest to appear often as a violently divided thirdly saying some yoruba persons are free to advocate restructuring why do you seem to insist that other yoruba persons are sinning by advocating yoruba nation and they deserve to be insulted and crucified fourthly here is something we have never wanted to raise because of our respect for our ferry ferry it is the history of how we yoruba people have become like slaves in nigeria the whole world knows how this disaster befall the yoruba and the, the generation that bears the historical responsibility for it does it make sense that the same generation should still be pushing our nation deeper and deeper into slavery finally watch again the interview of a professor akintoye with dr abati when professor akintoye referred to afeni ferry and the restructuring observe his respectful language also observe his explanation about restructuring why can't we all emulate this man what we are saying is that enough is enough for those yoruba leaders who are trying to truncate our efforts Payo Adebanjo should desist from calling himself a Yoruba leader because we youth won't allow our future to be mortgaged by him. 
we don't have confidence in him anymore and then henceforth he should stop parading himself as a fairy fairy leader we are also coming for those traditional rulers who usually bestow chieftaincy titles on the Fulanese in Yoruba land. Youth are ready to fight for their right. Chief Obafemi Awolowo had said it before. Now that when it is time, youth will rise up to fight for Yoruba nation. The youth group maintained. All right, now exactly waiting to happen. The day so on to this one. The youth don't come outside and then they don't clear this man. They, in fact, eh, most especially, Payade Banjo on to this next level. That like this, like this, so we know even one two as our our leader, the only leader we we know. Now him be Professor Banji, Akinto ye and the Chief Sunday Igboho. According to waiting the people them they talk about onto this one and then now everybody don't show the concern. Say with everything we be say una they do say restructuring. We not say na for na pockets una they fight because as far as the Yoruba nation is concerned, we no say una no day for us at all at all. Okay now everybody don't react to in different different ways onto this matter. Yes. Yeah, so Hmm. all of you combined are dead on arrival your parents will tell you not to cross the red line but if you do there would be dead consequences okay now this one full animal they talk oh, onto this one name now ahmed garba okay according to michael tinumbu says well yoruba leaders and then afeni ferry are confused because their son is the president they have forgotten that they will be back to square one when tinumbu leave office without serving bihafra and the odidua republic's agitation okay well my brother my sister this one are the strong one where will they talk about now that our own day there i don't tell everybody about this one now now yoruba man day there why would the yoruba man no go if use the opportunity now to make sure say the yoruba people get the yoruba nation because as it be so after eight years ah yes eight years hmm, only god know whether na full and go see take over because we don't know whether the the Hebrew self ready for all those ones but as it be now i think this is the time where we say the president he go do the needful hmm, now yoruba look on now though they don't talk and say the president no say our local but him they talk about himself and his own family say a me local all right oh, and then as so it can be on to this one we are saying make a letter and i know as the art as the bono well my people if this one are your first time we'll be saying you they join us try make you subscribe or share make you like our work oh, as it is hmm now so it can be on to this one until i come on our way next time i say on a bye for now